What I told you last week. If it says it, believe it. Believe it exactly the way it says it. And if you don't understand it, don't worry about it. God will supply the understanding as maybe as you grow and as, as a Christian. And I'm still growing and maturing as a believer. I still got things that I want to learn and understand. But in the absence of you being able to understand the Bible, believe the Bible. Believe what it says. It, God's Word will never mislead you. This stuff will. 85 pages of this book to try to tell you, don't believe 1 John 5, 7. It shouldn't be in the Bible to begin with. And don't believe what it says about the Father, the Word, and the Holy Ghost. And these three are one. It's telling you, don't believe that. God said, your Bible says, believe it. So who are you going to call here? Okay? You're going to believe the Bible? Or you're going to believe this kind of nonsense here? And this a man telling you, don't believe what you read in there. It doesn't mean what you think it means. And yet you're looking at it going, well, I believe what it says. Just trust that one. Let God be true and every man a liar. That means, Father, I love your word. This Bible's right. It has to be right in everything it says, God, because, God, there isn't a man on this earth that I trust, including me. God, I can't even have confidence in myself and my own thinking, because you told me, lean not to your own understanding. In all thy ways, acknowledge him. And so, God, this Bible has to be right, because I just don't trust anything down here. God, I've been... Burnt too many times, have been lied to too many times, have been tried to pull away. And God, I just don't have any confidence in men anymore, God, but I sure do believe and thank you for this book. It is right in everything it says. It's been preserved. Some evil man did not add verses to the Bible to make it sound like what they wanted to be, but Lord, there's sure enough people around that are trying to take stuff out of the Bible that they don't like. God, you judge them however you're going to judge them. But God, Lord, help, teach your people. Teach your people, God, that they can believe exactly what this book says. And that God, in time, you'll provide greater understanding for it. And we'll believe it even further. We'll believe it more. God, give us faith. And Lord, increase our faith like the disciples asked you. We want to believe more and more. We want to be able to stand stronger as the days get darker and darker and more evil. We want our faith to increase. God, do that. Help us to trust this word no matter what comes. Bless your word in Jesus' name and all of God's people said. Amen. Amen. God bless you. You're dismissed. Good, good lesson tonight.